Yeah. YouTube, what's good? Back with another video. Hey, happy 4th to y'all, y'all. Happy 4th of July to y'all. If you even celebrate this holiday, you know what I'm saying? Happy 4th of July. Um, if you're doing something today, if you're going out or whatever, be safe. Don't drink and drive, none of that foolishness, all right? There's too many ways to get home safely than to try to put your life in jeopardy. And I know some of you goofballs is out there like, I drive better when I'm drunk. Just be safe, all right? All right? But today, today's video is um, really much based around this one single topic. Did you go to the gym today? Did you work out today? Did you put your time in? Huh? Did you? Did you put your time in? Did you? Oh, what the fuck? Did you drink your motherfucking water? Did you drink your fucking water today? Huh? Did you do anything productive today? Did you do push ups, sit ups, anything? Pull ups, dips, anything? Did you work out today? Did you? Because that's what this video is about earning your leisure. Right? Earning your leisure, earning your free time. Right? Because, oh shit. Because motherfuckers like to only come around, only like to do the good stuff. You only like to do the good stuff, right? If you got a plate full of meat and, and sweet potatoes and vegetables, you're gonna wanna eat the stuff you like. Everybody pick around the vegetables. You only gonna you only want the good stuff. But you don't want to put the pain in. You don't want to do the hard stuff. You got to earn your leisure. You got to earn your free time. You ain't put no work in. Not even just talking about the gym. Anything you were supposed to do. You ain't put no work in. You don't deserve no free time. You don't deserve to be lazy right now. What, because it's a holiday? You think you get the day off? You think you deserve to have the day off because it's a holiday? You get to take a break from your normal routine? No, because now you're building a habit of not doing what you're supposed to do. Not doing what you're supposed to do. Not knowing that you putting in work today, this helps you stay consistent to yourself, to your own goals. Helps you keep the promises to yourself, right? Helps you stay ahead of the competition, right? Because we know what the competition doing. They out partying right now. They probably already lit up. They already probably lit. They probably two plates in on a barbecue, right? They probably stuffed their face, probably sitting there, stomach busting out the seams, right? They didn't even go to the gym, but they gonna eat all them calories, get lit up, be behind the schedule, be behind the curve for tomorrow, cause you gotta, you gotta wait that hangover off, then you gotta, you gotta wait for all that food to process, and then you gonna still be eating leftovers for the next couple days. You know what I'm saying? Not counting none of that, just over, over, over indulging in your in caloric intake, all kinds of shit, right? Sugary drinks and fun stuff. Yeah, it's cool, it's good. You can have a good time. I'm not saying don't have fun today. Like, I'm not saying don't have fun this weekend. What I'm saying is, did you earn it? Are you, are you allowed? Are you even able, right? Did you, do you have enough work put in do you have enough of a threshold between the work you put in and your play time are you working hard enough to even play that hard huh now y'all just playing hard ain't put no hard work in do a little bit of work do a little bit of work and then play hard right just did enough did, did a little bit of work you know the dudes that be at work you know just just doing enough to get by doing enough that they don't get in trouble you know, doing enough to stay under the radar, right? You know them dudes, and then want all the credibility. They want they want the recognition and all the credibility of this other shit, but only do bare minimum. Only do a little bit of the work, right? We don't we don't fuck with that kind of shit. We, we don't fuck with them kind of people, right? But is that you? Is that you? And be honest with yourself. Is that you? Huh? Did you, do you? Are you putting in the maximum amount of work that you need to? To be allotted the time to play. Right? You're too busy worrying about all the, all the good stuff. Like all the fun stuff. 
bitches, drinks, parties, all that other shit. Didn't do no work. What kind of work did you put in for yourself? Huh? How, how hard have you been working on yourself? Hmm? Have you been going to the gym consistently, intensely? Have you been reading books frequently? Have you been reading books more so often than you watching TV or watching YouTube videos or whatever it is that you indulge in? Have you been eating healthier than you eating bullshit? Hmm? Have you been working on your skincare? Are you, or are you just like, fuck it, I have you been taking care of yourself? Hmm? Whatever it is that you're supposed to be doing, whatever your goals is, whatever your, I don't know what your pathway is, right? Are you putting in the proper amount of work in that field? Tell the truth, because if you're not, then you don't deserve your leisure just yet. Men, we have a tendency to want to be comfortable because, you know, that's why we value peace more than anything. Because we don't get it. You know, that's why we have a tendency to be, to tendency to want to relax. Right? But if we, but we all know that, that struggle and, and hardships is what keeps society moving forward. Right? Not saying you have to be in dire straits right now. You don't gotta be going through the most traumatic experiences right now for you to be going forward. But a little bit of fire under your ass keeps you moving forward. Because you get comfortable, you get complacent. You stop growing. We don't want that to happen. Especially if you did not earn it. You feel what I'm saying? That's all I'm getting at. You can have fun. Like, I just left the gym. I just left the gym. I'm finna go shower. We finna make tacos tonight. We finna make them barrier tacos. You know, the one with the juice. We finna do that tonight. You know, chill, probably kick back. You know, chill shit. But I earned my leisure. I just went to the gym, just put that pain in, did an hour and a half. And I did all my work I needed to do this morning. Made my espresso. Made my espresso, did my work. Got dressed, went to the gym, just getting back, about to go, now we about to go do dinner and shit. Got up early too. Didn't wait, just didn't get up like, didn't get up late, got up early today. Right? So you got, it's just gotta be a balance. You know what I'm saying? It's not, don't overwork yourself without giving yourself the proper amount of relaxation and free time. But on the other hand, too, don't overindulge in relaxation and you know you ain't damn near put enough work in. Right? It's all about being consistent, but being balanced. You can be consistently, you can be consistently productive like you're supposed to and have the proper amount of relaxation throughout there. Right? You can do your hard, you can have your five days out of the week or maybe even six. I don't know how often, how hard you're working. But you have your one day of the week or whatever you got, your two days of the week that you, you know, take your break or do something that's relaxing to you or it's just sitting in silence. You go to a cigar bar, you go whatever to the beach. You just go kick back in silence. As long as you are being honest with yourself that you putting in the right amount of work. Right? Because everything at the end of the year, when you add up, you add up, you got to win the days. Are you winning the days? Because at the end of the year, when you tally up the score, the results don't lie about what you did this year. The results is not gonna lie. When you look at your when you look at your sheet or whatever you got, you be like how many days of the year did I win? It is gonna you're gonna see your and, and whatever the progress you made is gonna be your results. Your results, your results is based on your everyday habits routines and, and disciplines so if your body looks crazy at the end of the year but it didn't look like that at the beginning of the year we know you we know we know what's the truth you can sit there and say yeah i was being consistent in the gym i was going every day blah blah but why does your body look like that 
Hmm? You can sit there and say, yeah, I've been saving up for this day and the third and you get to the end of the year and you broke. I wasn't dealing with none of these girls, you know, I was focusing on myself. Boom, got three bitches pregnant. Results don't lie. Right? So, moral of the story, earn your leisure, right? It's okay. It is all right to enjoy your free time. It's okay to relax. It's okay to take a break. It's okay to enjoy the holiday, but earn it. Earn it, okay? Put in enough work so that when the time does come for you and you have the opportunity to take that free time, you know you deserve it. You know that you've earned it. But if you ain't did shit all week, you ain't did nothing all week, and now you think you just go come on a holiday and just be like, yeah, I can definitely turn up, definitely eat all this food, ain't put no work in, you dead wrong. You dead wrong. All right? But that's all I got for y'all, man. Earn your leisure. Um, until next time, yo, it's Wolfgang Peak. This is Wolfgang Lifestyle. Be safe. Drink your fucking water. And I'm out.